Hey y'all, I'm Sarah from the Arabia Mountain Heritage Area Alliance, and I wanted to pop back on here to kind of share with you my history harvest at home journey. Um, it's progressing just a little bit. So as you may remember in my last video, I was sharing this photo with y'all of my grandmother. Um, I didn't really know much about it. Um, I knew that it was my grandmother and I knew that it was probably taken somewhere in Wisconsin where she grew up, but I didn't really know much else about where this was or anything like that. And so I decided to ask my mom um, because I couldn't ask my grandmother. So what I learned is that my grandmother grew up uh, on a farm in rural Wisconsin, but during the Great Depression, her family actually had to sell the farm and move to Madison, Wisconsin, so essentially move into the city because they couldn't survive anymore on their farm. So that was something that I, I never really knew about my grandmother. Um, I guess I sort of always knew that she lived during the Great Depression, but I never really knew what impact that had on her life. And so another cool thing that just happened was I was going through some historic documents, going through the census, and I was looking um, at the information uh, during the time when they lived in Madison. And I discovered that, that during that time in 1940, my grandmother worked at an ice cream shop, which is kind of cool if you like ice cream. But one thing that I remembered was that there was a photograph of her in that collection of photos that I shared earlier of her in a uniform. So I wanna share that with y'all. So there she is, and I'm assuming this is her uniform for when she worked at the ice cream shop. So that was a fun discovery that I found uh, just today. Um, so we wanna know how you're doing with your history harvest at home. Have you been able to dig up any old family photographs or letters or any other sort of special mementos? We would love to see what you found. You can share your items with us by using the hashtag history harvest at home on social media and also tagging us on our social media channels. Now, if you don't feel like sharing what you find publicly, but are interested in sharing with us, we've set up a website and a place for you to submit your discoveries. And we'll link that website below. We hope that you are doing well. We hope that you are discovering your family story. And next up, I'm gonna share some items that we received from the Vodders family that help us tell the story of the Vodders farm within the Arabian Mountain National Heritage Area. Until next time. Take care and be well.